okay uh, in this video i am going to demonstrate how to integrate selenium mcp server with your ai tool ai agent so before go to that i will explain what is mcp so if i go to mcp official github repository you can see mcp is standard for model context protocol which uh, it's an open protocol that enable seamless integration between llm applications and external data source and tools data sources and tools so i will explain this uh, with example so if i open my ai agent so here i am using cloud in this ai tool i am going to ask open from browser and navigate to google.com this is my uh, request for this cloud AI agent. Let's see what is the reply. Here you can see it will say I can't directly open Chrome or navigate to website for you as an AI assistant. I don't have the ability to control your computer, open application or interact with your web browser. So which means this mcp host which means your ai tool it can be cloud or it can be cursor cannot directly access this chrome browser or any other file system in your machine okay so now the issue is your ai tool cannot access your chrome browser or your database or your local file system in your machine so what mcp does so if we integrate this mcp server in between your ai application and your tools this MCP server in enable and integrate your AI application with your machine tools. It can be a Chrome browser, it can be your database, it can be your local file system. So if I go to their official website, you can see uh, this MCP open protocol that enables seamless integration between LLM application, which means your AI tool and external data source and tools which means this mcp enable to integrate between your ai application and other tools so in my case so i want to open chrome browser in my using my ai tool so because of that i need to integrate selenium mcp server in between my ai tool and chrome browser so then my ai tool can give introduction to selenium mcp server so the same selenium mcp server can open the chrome browser in my machine okay uh, so now we are going to integrate this uh, selenium mcp server uh, this selenium mcp server in our ai tool which means cloud so in cloud you can go to file settings and you can see the developer option developer button and inside this developer you can see the edit config button if i click on this edit config button it will open this directory and i need to open this cloud desktop config.json file right now this file is empty i need to add the code mcp selenium code inside this json file so if i go to selenium mcp server and here you can see the code i need to add that json file this one so i will copy this one and i will add this to here and save it so now it will take little time to integrate that mcp server with your ai tool so the best way is you can close cloud and reopen it again will reopen it okay uh, so here now you can see here uh, 14 mcp tools are available now if i click here you can see now you can click on element close session you can double click so those kind of actions you can do with this cloud now so right now we have integrated this selenium mcp server in between your ai tool which means cloud and your machine okay 
so if i go to mcp selenium mcp server repository also you can see what are the actions we can do using this selenium mcp server you can do the navigation you can do the find element you can do the click element so this type of actions you can do using this selenium mcp server okay uh, so right now i am going to give in instruction to open chrome browser in my machine and go to google.com uh, let's see how it works open chrome browser and navigate to google.com can see the chrome browser is open and you can see now it navigate to google.com so and also i will successfully open chrome and navigate to google home page as you see now we integrate this selenium mcp server in my ai tool in here i integrate the selenium mcp server with my cloud ai tool so now you can do these kind of activities using selenium server so you can open browser you can navigate to site you can find element you can click on element you can type something on element uh, you can do these kind of uh, actions using using this cloud because we uh, we integrate selenium mcp server with this cloud tool so likewise you can if you want to integrate your playwright mcp server you can do that one too uh, you can go to this selenium play, uh, playwright mcp server repository and you can find the configuration here and you can add this configuration in your uh, cloud configuration file and you can do the playwright actions also so in my next video i will uh, show you how to do simple automation using uh, this uh, selenium mcp server okay thank you